good morning. It is a Wednesday morning. It is five past seven. It is almost time for our live space to commence. We are going to be doing our morning stretch like we do every Monday to Friday at the moment, live in our hangout space. Somebody off somewhere nice, I hope. <laughs> All right, let's have another wonderful day. every day to raise the energy and change the world. All right, we are trying not to hit people. <laughs> okay, give us a like if you like this video, thumbs up, that'd be awesome. Subscribe to our channel to see us every single day. Leave a friendly comment and start a conversation. This is our morning dance. Are you ready to raise the energy with us? Let's do it. Let's have a dance. Awesome. <sighs> Some dancing Nirvana styley. That was tiring. That was tiring. All right. Well, thank you for joining us today. Stick a song suggestion below for tomorrow. Well, you, to say next, huh? you never know. We might choose it. Stick a what? Stick a song suggestion. Song suggestion. <laughs> All right. We'll see you tomorrow morning. Thank you, guys. Lots of love. Have a great day. See you in the morning. Bye. Bye. Gemma hugs out the live space. That's really cool. Alrighty. Day 553 in the bag. And look. It's looking nice. <laughs> oh, right. No matter how much sleep you get, you can get back up and raise the energy every morning. That is what we're learning in this house. So, breakfast time then. Bruce is heading into Bruce is heading into Edinburgh. See him over there. It's very bright. Wow. Look at all those fans. Work going on, not in our house today. Our house is having a break from work people, which is nice because for since I don't know four days, a big giant toolbox sat there and all across my house were like giant tools and saws and drills. Hello, buddy, you look super sweet. Hi, Gemma, you're sounding very sweet. Good mythical morning, still on. I remember to know who it is. Grandma. Hey, gorgeous. What, have you trying to put your face on me? Oh, you're a fairy doggy, of course. Hello, fairy doggy. So, guys, what are we going to do today? What time's your hospital appointment at? Gemma has her annual, her first one year anniversary annual check up at the hospital on her diabetes, so it's an extra long appointment today. I'm thinking it might be better for just you and Dad. Because if Bodhi comes, if we all go, we're not going to hear much, and it's an important appointment. 
because I want Daddy to have a look at the orange pen. Make sure Daddy gets a demonstration of the orange pen. We have an emergency orange pen, which if Gemma gets really, really bad, we have to inject in her. Um, but I was shown it once over a year ago when I'd had like no sleep for three days in ICU. And I remember them showing me this and thinking, I hope you show me this again at some point. So we're a year on and Bruce has never seen it. So I'm hoping that Daddy will get to see that today. So we know what to do in case of an emergency. Yes! I need to come outside. Hello? Please come outside. I'll come outside. Oh, okay. I, I it's so this. cold. I thought the frisbee was away. You thought the frisbee was away? Do you think the frisbee's still next door then? I wouldn't imagine it'll have gone far. No, it's still there. Come yeah. on, sunshine. The <laughs> Warm it up. And the bumblebee right there. It's a bumblebee. I see. It's, it's a wee bitty cold. Oh, boy. Would you loud in there? Cold or loud? Cold or loud? Cold or loud? Oh, I lost my shoe! I lost my shoe! Could you bring my shoe in, please, buddy? Yeah, very good. Okay, hey, boo! You've got a big toe, you do. You're wearing my big shoe. You're squeezing me to death. I'm cuddling you. Yeah, anaconda. We're making Play Doh ice cream for Gemma. Excellent. Here it is. Very good. Mm, yeah. Okay. Can kind of off the mat there, aren't you? There we go. You can kind of. Very good. Enjoy. Play Doh time. Play Doh. Hidden away. Gemma is doing something Minecrafty. Oh yeah. And I wanna do that. And Bodie's playing some old N64 Pokemon. Up, right, up, right. Can you do that? Up, right, up, right. That's right. You've got to press it on the control. Good luck with that. Mm -hmm. Are you eating lots of food? You've got to press the A button, the blue, the blue button to eat your food. You're the blue character who's jumping around just now. So you've got to move your character to get some food. I'm getting some Photoshop work done, helping Bodie get into her baby toys. She's very happy. She's being a baby. We've had a puppy dog most of the day, but we're, back, we're being a baby now. Jenna is still watching. Good mythical morning and playing Minecraft. Excellent. I should make her lunch at some point soon. I want to try and get my work finished on Photoshop first. Oh, hello, look. Hello. Look at Bruce. Hello, Bruce. Just hello. giving everybody a quick update. All right. Yes, all right. Baby's being a baby. Jenna's still playing Minecraft. And I'm still doing tasks that I really need to get other people doing. <laughs> Yes, indeed. So if you've uh, got between sort of four and six hours available each week to do some wonderful administrative <laughs> data entry stuff to help me out, uh, there's, a, there's a remote working position available for that. So if you've got the skills, you might have some bills. I've <laughs> got plenty of bills. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, so. Lunch is next on the agenda. I want to try and get my last edit done on Photoshop and then I'll get lunch for Gemma so she can go out to the hospital. Gemma's soup is ready. Here we 
go to Emma. Emma has asked to say thing Minecraft because apparently there's something going on that's so important. Alright, Cody is deciding that she's still a baby and is watching Teletubbies in the high chair. Alrighty. Your lunch is ready, I'll get that out. Next. Hello, baby body. So this takes me back a bit. Kid in a high chair watching Mr. Tumble. Does Ivy watch Mr. Tumble? Ivy does watch Mr. Tumble, yes. Hello, Mr. Tumble. Oh, yes, the magic. I've got a very sad body here who wants to go to the hospital with her sister. I was trying to explain to her this is a one and a half hour appointment and it should have to be quiet for an hour and a half. So we're... Thinking is better off. The body stays with me and daddy goes and daddy might actually get to hear something. Mm, and I won't. And you won't? No, you get to stay here with me. You, you won't hear the doctor speak for an hour and a half. <laughs> That's like watching a movie. Oh. Where you can't move. A diabetes mm. movie. It's all about your sister. Mm. <laughs> Is he silly? Yeah. He's turning the car around in the driveway. Go. Bye, Daddy. Bye, Gemma. Mm. See you soon. Right. I Watching Paw Patrol. Kiss on my head. Hello, Jess. <laughs> my afternoon buzzing. <laughs> I'm learning all about Paw Patrol today. Yeah. Oh no, what's happening then? Have we had a fire evacuation in the clinic? We didn't even get as well, we got as far as the reception desk, didn't we? And we were talking to the lady, she was just about to check us in. And we've ended up with the fire engines here and everybody's out of the building. I'm not going to turn around and show for everybody, but a few people are standing there yourself and there's people all around there and stuff like that. So we're just kind of, yeah, now waiting. Didn't even get inside for a seat. What's all that about? The alarm's still going. Still going? Yeah. There's one fireman going in. One! Is there? At least you put two in. Two! two in. Yep. Alright. So we're going back into the, the clinic now. Um, from what I could overhear, it was a, a fan or something. So I think it's maybe something electrical is tripped or kicked something what out or I don't know. Ah, because I kept my ears open as we were walking out of the, the main building who we were moved over to another part of the hospital to the antenatal clinic, so. Uh, that's why we were at the back last time. That's why we were at the back last time. And we were at the back last time. Yep. We could have been there. We could have been. Well, let's go in. Here we are, Jim. We're the last ones here. We've been in that, in that consultation for so long having a review that everyone else has gone. We're just waiting on... We're just gonna wait on... an appointment with the doctor and we'll talk to him for a while. Go on, give it a try. Yeah, go on, okay. Just put it there. So we are back in the car after being in at the hospital for how long? Like three hours. Like three hours. Yeah. Usually it takes about an hour and a half, but that was three hours because there was a fire evacuation to begin with, 
and we were outside or not able to get in for about 45 minutes and then everybody went in at the same time and then we eventually got seen and by the time we came out from seeing Anna, the nurse, mm -hmm. and we came back into the waiting area, everybody was gone. Like literally. And it was just like us and the doctor and another nurse that was about. So we went in and saw the doctor and spoke to him and we've got an adjustment on your base insulin, your basal insulin, your <laughs> levomere. So we're stepping up half a unit in the mornings, but other than that, everything's like pretty good. Five and a half. That's right. Okay, so now we're going to go home, that it's half past five, we're going to go home, see if Mummy's maybe able to get us something sorted out for dinner. Um, yeah, see how that goes. Anyway. Okay. All right, Gemma's home from the hospital. Hi, Gemma. How was your three-hour appointment? It wasn't three hours. Really? That's what you said. We were there for three hours. Three hours, what happened? Am I going to see it in the vlog? Yes. Yeah. Okay. We'll Wonderful. Oh, well, I'll, I'll look forward to seeing the footage then. Apparently, there was drama. But we're not seeing Dinner time! We want to see it. <laughs> we're having stir fry tonight. Yeah. That's what I looked in my cuddles. Cuddles? Oh my goodness. Cupboards for cuddles, cupboards, same thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh, alright. I think it's time for Mummy to sit there and have some dinner. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, let's do it. Is it nice, Gemma? Good. Mummy! Yes, eh? That's the tree! I know. It is, it is actually raining. Bodhi wants to go play in the swings. She's not been playing on the swings for maybe two or three days. It's just been not nice enough. Last night would have probably been the night to play in the swing, but it was that night. <laughs> All right, I'm going to wrap this vlog up here today. Thank you very much for joining us. We shall be back here bright and early in the morning again for more live stretching. Maybe I should jump in the shower tonight. What do you think? I wanted to do it today and I just didn't get a chance. So, see you in the morning. Bye now.